Welcome to this week's edition of Fingerprinting Gurus. I am Tommy Watkins, your instructor, here for an exciting new topic. Before diving into this week's subject matter, I kind of request that you support our content by liking, sharing, and subscribing. Our content aims to assist you in advancing your entrepreneur ventures, particularly in the ink card uh, fingerprinting business and the mobile ink card fingerprinting uh, industry. Without further ado, let us explore this week's topic, how ink card fingerprinting works. Ink card uh, fingerprinting, ladies and gentlemen, also known as tradi traditional fingerprinting, is a method used to capture and record an individual's fingerprint using ink and paper. Here is a step-by-step -step explanation of how the process works. Preparation. The technician prepares the necessary equipment, including fingerprint cards, uh, fingerprint ink pad, and cleaning supplies. They also ensure that the area is well lit and free from distractions. Next will be identification. The individual providing uh, their fingerprints present valid identification, confirm their identity. Uh, this step is crucial for verifying the person's identity and ensuring the accuracy of the uh, fingerprint records. Next will be ink application. The technician applies a thin layer of fingerprint ink onto the individual fingertip. The ink is usually is typically a specialized form of that adheres well to the ridges of the skin while minimizing smudging and smearing. Next, fingerprint. The individual then rolls each fingertip onto the fingerprint card starting from one side and rolling towards the other in a specific pattern. This process capture the unique ridge patterns of each fingerprint onto the fingerprint card. Next, repeat each finger. The technician uh, repeats the fingerprinting process for all fingers of both hands, including thumb. Each fingerprint is carefully rolled onto the designated area on the fingerprint card to ensure clarity and accuracy. Next, quality check. After capturing all fingerprints, the technician inspects the quality of the uh, impressions to ensure that they are clear and legible. Any smudges or incomplete, incomplete uh, prints may be required re-inking or re-fingerprinting to obtain satisfactory results. Next, documentation. Once all fingerprints are successfully recorded, the technician fills out any required information on the fingerprint card, including individuals, um, person's details, such as name, date of birth, and identification number. Next, cleaning. After completing the fingerprint process, the technician cleans the individual's fingertips to remove any residue uh, ink. This ensures that the individual can leave without uh, any uh, residue on their hands. Next would be storage and submission. The complete fingerprint card is stored securely or submitted to the appropriate authorities depending on the purpose of the fingerprinting. The fingerprints may be uh, used for background checks, criminal records, employment screening, or other legal and identification purposes. Confirmation. Uh, the individual may receive a receipt or confirmation of the fingerprint process for their records. This documentation serves as proof that their fingerprints have been recorded and can be used as needed. Ink card fingerprinting remains a widely used method for capturing fingerprints accurately and reliably and particularly in the situations where digital fingerprinting technology is not available or practical. Like, share, comment, and subscribe to this content.